Park is getting a new name. The Aretha Franklin Amphitheater will be in place where the Queen of Soul will live forever. 7 Action News reporter Simon Chowdhury shows us how the family is reacting to this honor. Eight yays, zero nays. And with that, the city of Detroit honors Aretha Franklin. You all know what Shane Park means uh, to this city historically. Uh, and to rename that music venue for the Queen of Soul, I think is the right thing to do. Oh my God, it's so amazing. The singer's niece, Crystal Franklin, was on hand for the unanimous city council vote to change the name of Shane Park to the Aretha Franklin Amphitheater. She says it was Mayor Mike Duggan's idea. Amphitheater is only befitting of my aunt. She was all of that. She was music, she was theater, she was television. The name change is expected to officially take place next season. Shane Park was the spot of last Thursday's tribute concert. Early in Franklin produced the program. She loved Shane Park. She liked the uniqueness of it. She liked the fact that it was on the river. Aretha Franklin performed at Shane Park in 1992 for her niece's high school graduation. Crystal says her aunt would be surprised by the honor. She probably would be like, oh, guys, it does. you don't have to do that. She was so humble. She wasn't. She would have never expected this. Tickets for the next season will go on sale starting on Black Friday. Now, we're told that will be one of the first times you'll notice the official name change. On the Riverfront, Simon Chowdhury, 7 Action News. All right, Simon, thank you. We're going to go to breaking news.